this is it. This is the final month for my Monster Bass subscription. Today, you and I are going to take a look and see, is this one worth it? Let's do it. So let me go. If you're new to the, the subscription fishing tackle box world, Monster Bass is a monthly subscription that is 34, 35 bucks. Every month they send you this great bag that's reusable. Probably the, one of the best things about Monster Bass is this bag that you can use for tackle and other stuff. It's probably four or five dollars retail value, but it's, it's an added bonus every month. And like I said in the intro, this is my last month for Monster Bass, and there's many reasons why. But today, we're not going to go through all that. Today, what we're going to do is we're just going to look at what's inside the bag. First off, is it quality products? Second off, what is the fishability of the products that we got? But to the, we're going to look at it and uh, see how it compares. How, what's inside? Is it worth the money? And then we put an overall value at the end too. So here we go. Like normal, there's lots of extra things in here. You can get a free Excite bait, free bait coupon if you uh, do something. Oh, if you purchase anything $5 or more, you can use that. I don't know why it's not. There you go. There it focused. Uh, if you want the Monster Bass Golden Ticket, they've got that for you too. You can win that. It calls out that number right there. They give you a Monster Bass sticker. They tell you about the new Seeker series, which dives six foot. Seeker eight dives eight, and Seeker twelve. I guess we're getting one of those in the box. There's that, and then they always give you a little pamphlet that tells you what is in here. And this month it is Alex Rudd handpicked baits for where you live and fish, and what's inside of it prices so we'll get rid of all of that stuff and start off they started us off with some z-man zinkers now one of the good things about monster bass is they do send you full packs that is a positive there are people that don't send you full packs and those ones stink next from kvd perfect plastics this is the Ned Ocho. From there, they gave us on the spot baits, custom hand cords in the United States. These are the three inch baby brush hog in the dingleberry color. Next, they sent us the Monster Bass Seeker 6 that dives 4 to 5 feet. From there, they gave us a Lucky Strike. What bait is this? This is the Shallow Smoothie. See that one right there? A little crankbait. I don't know why the camera isn't focusing. There you go. Might be too far away. That one dives. I don't even know how much that one dives. It's a shallow smoothie, so three eighths ounce. Looks like it probably goes three to five feet, so not bad. Next from Castaic, the CXV75 lipless crankbait. From there, they gave us an Excite weight transfer system. XB5, which dives two to five feet deep. Nice looking color on that bait. They sent us some Monster Bass Terminal Tackle. Ryan airs it out all alone. Juggled. Incomplete. Sorry, it dropped it. Not bad. Looks like some shaky heads or something like that. Yeah, with tungsten, I guess. I don't even know. I'm sure you kids. And then last but not least, as I continue to drop things, they sent some Big Bite Baits Coontail in Junebug. 
in terms of the quality of products, I of course know Big Bite Baits, I know Castaic, I know Lucky Strike, I know Excite, not a big fan of them, but that's all right. I don't know On The Spot, and, and that's it. I know Z-Man, I know KVD. So of all the things I don't know, I would say even though I think these are going to start to be sold in Walmart and stuff, so that'll be great for Monster Bass and congratulations. I wouldn't put those as the best baits on the market, but the on the spot I don't know either. But that doesn't mean that these aren't, you know, they're it's a Monster Bass product. I mean, it's, it is what it is. Uh, in terms of the name brand in this bag, I'm going to give this an eight and a half. Um, well, you know, I said I was going to do odd numbers. So this one is an 8.27. Um, in terms of fishability, I think I can fish almost everything in here. I think maybe one might be just a little bit, that new seeker might be a little bit, how weird is that, oh, this light is moving. Uh, the seeker might be a little bit hard to fish. If you're a shore fisherman, some of those crankbaits are, are gonna be a little tough to fish, but overall, not bad. I'm gonna give the fishability of this a 8.79 uh, but overall a much better month than last month because I thought last month there was just too much too many things that I never heard of um, so Z-Man is always a good product everything in here is pretty decent and 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 kind of in the in, in what we're gonna start fishing here in November and December and stuff like that so size wise the baits are good size because we're going to be looking at shad and stuff like that. And the baits are, are pretty good too. So a much better box or bag than last month. Uh, is it going to make me go out and subscribe again? Probably not. I want to see an improvement. And I know Rick is, and Rick and his team are, are pushing forward to make the best bag that they can for the money. So hats off to them for a good, a good month. Not great, but good. This is good quality. I would say a couple things are a little weird, but still a pretty good bag or box. Uh, if you want more information, you want to subscribe to them, I suggest you go to monsterbass.com. There's a lot of people that are pro staff for Monster Bass. And so I would, if it was me, I would go back and look at some other people's videos and use their code so you can save like 10 bucks on the first one. I do not have that code, but there's other people that do. So. Tell me what you think. Comment below and tell me exactly what your rating is. Rating for the value, or the not the value, the name of the product and also the fishability in your area. Because your fishability is going to be different than my fishability. And this is the South Edition. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for subscribing and hitting that notification bell. I really do appreciate it. Remember, comment below. And if you want to help support the channel, give this a thumbs up. Guys, remember to do a few things. Take a kid fishing, get your fish on, hold it, hold it, hold it, there it is. I'll see you guys soon. Cheers. Hit like and subscribe, take your own kids fishing.